So that's why we have our patent pending technology of the lipomycelin matrix, where we have figured out how to stabilize it during digestion, which means that you're getting enhanced absorption of it. You're actually going to get this clinically effective dose of 600 milligrams mm -hmm. um, in it. And it's just, it's an amazing product for anybody. I think about you know, if you're under stress, environmental stress, emotional stress, stress, is not good for ourselves right uh or if you're especially if you're concerned about exposures to toxins in your diet or environment think about master of all antioxidants peat extract has some of the highest amounts of trace minerals and antioxidants what we call polyphenols another category of antioxidants that exist on the planet mm -hmm. so it's it's a really wonderful way to get super highly concentrated nutrients i mean we're not out there eating dirt every day right yeah. <laughs> or peat which peat is like literally like you know okay. thousands of year old plants that are rotting and broken down in each other we're not out there eating that every day <laughs>
our DNA. So, you know, multiple health problems, it accelerates the aging process that apple is now aging more rapidly than mm. it would if it stayed complete. Um, and it's not just internal. There are external factors that actually can also increase the free radical oxidation process. So pollution, radiation, tobacco right. smoke, all of these things cause our cells to essentially age more rapidly. So our body has a defense system. And to counteract the harmful effects of these free radicals, and that is antioxidants. They've neutralized the free radicals. And I mean, we could get into the fun chemistry of it. I kind of geek out on it, right? Yeah. Because they're like donating electrons and all these things. But essentially, it's stabilizing them. The free radicals still exist, but they're they're happy. It's like, oh, they met their partner. They, you know come together they fall in love <laughs> mm -hmm. and then they're not they're not cranky anymore right and they're not causing problems sometimes. so it's not just kidding sometimes yeah right it's the balance between the free radicals and the antioxidants that we want to see happen but when it's disrupted like i said pollution you know we're ill we're not we're not getting enough antioxidants in our bodies from our food sources or from supplementation that's when we start seeing all of these negative effects. And so I, I do think that supplements, um, antioxidant supplements are a necessary tool, right? I mean, we can talk about trying to get as much as we can from our food, but nowadays our food is limited in the amount of right. nutrients that it has in there. And obviously our environment is so much more full of these toxins that are plaguing us. So right. we, we turn to antioxidants. There's that like uh, ideal scenario. Oh, you can get it all from food, right? But the soils are depleted. Supplements mm -hmm. are a form of technology. I've been looking at it like that lately. Like, do oh, you still I write a handwritten? Do you, do you still write a handwritten letter <laughs> and email people and mail it to people? No, you do hmm. email, right? It's just, it's a way of improving humanity and human health. Now we have research to produce these supplements. Like, so I love that you mentioned that you can get them in supplemental form, yeah. like a product like Regener Life. I've taken like this. A it's a powder. Like Tell us about it. Yeah. So Regenera Life is a mitochondrial food. So, you know, and that's another thing that we've probably talked about or discussed on the podcast at some point, time or another. There is this overarching idea that, you know, when inflammation is out of balance, all chronic disease originates from inflammation. I don't necessarily think that this is an accurate statement anymore. Now, for me, it is mitochondrial dysfunction is the root cause of okay. all disease states and antioxidants play a huge role in keeping our cells happy and our mitochondria is inside our cell right so if free radicals are attacking our cells our cells are aging our mitochondria is aging more quickly than it should this is where the cascade of so many things happens. So ironically, we have this formula, which I should, we should come back and talk about just mitochondria someday, mm -hmm. um, which is Regenera Life. But, you know, if you break down the ingredients that are in there, these are all super, super highly potent antioxidants. Some of the, hmm. you know, top ones that we know exist. So that's where I always come back and it's like, yeah, you know, you could buy CoQ10, you could buy acetyl L-carnitine, you could buy superoxidase, dismutase, or SOD. You could buy these things separately, but they're all together in this one pretty awesome package, um, giving us, you know, something that's not only feeding our mitochondria, which is the energy suppliers for our body, but also keeping free radicals happy and at bay from damaging our cells. So it's like kind of a it's like a symphony. Benefit. Yeah, it's a double did, benefit there. Did you uh did you just say S O B or S O D? Let's hear that. S O D as okay. in <laughs> as in Dayon. <laughs> D as in Dayon, not, not B as in boy. Okay. So what is S O D? This is uh this is actually the main antioxidant enzyme that we have in our cells. So mm -hmm. it's something that exists in our body and we can actually supplement with it as well. Now, you know, like you were saying, like, it's really cool when we learn about things in our body, this is new technology that we have available. Yeah. Um, and SOD is one of those that, you know, we 
we saw, ooh, this is a really big part of antioxidants in ourselves. And we were able to isolate it. We were able to find it in certain foods um, and then, you know, be able to turn it into something that we can add into our, our supplementation. So really, really great for mitochondrial function and maintaining DNA um, in our cells as well. And you know what I mean by that technology analogy, right? Like it's always about nutrition where they say, oh, we can, we've always gotten it from food. But right. yet they're driving, they're using their cell phones, they're using their laptops. They're, that's okay to use the tech, but not when it comes to supplements, right? So that's just uh, something to think about. So yeah. so the SOD is in superoxide dismutase is in that Regenerolife formula? It is. There is a form of it in there, which is a really wonderful thing in addition to all of the other ingredients. And that's where I really look at this as like the synergy, right? It's about the synergy. Um, because even when we talk about antioxidants in general, there's a synergy happening there too, right. um, where, you know, everything is working together. We have certain antioxidants that are known as enzymatic antioxidants. We have non-enzymatic antioxidants, but they're complementing each other and helping to balance out these free radicals and antioxidants. So I always love that word synergy. It's like coming yeah. together as a group, working together. Um, and, you know, I want to, I want people to, uh, obtain a diverse range of antioxidants, right? So in our diet, that's why, that's why this was entitled. That's why I, I thought about like, you know, the rainbow, yeah. the antioxidant rainbow, because if we think about antioxidants that come from food, you know, there's pink foods or red foods. Well, think about a tomato. Lycopene is an antioxidant. That's really, really high amounts in tomatoes. Or vitamin C is actually an antioxidant. These bioflavonoids, you know, think about in your oranges or in your carrots. Right. So there's a lot of places that we can get these. Um, I, am I, I think the SOD is coming from a melon source. I might be lying about yep. that in here. Yeah, the cucumis okay, melon. Yeah. Oh. So see, so that's like that orange antioxidant, right? That's another color that's providing another type of antioxidant because there's so many different quercetin, you know, like, I mean, we could go on forever and ever and ever when we talk about different types of antioxidants, but then people don't think about things like CoQ10 being an antioxidant yes, um, or glutathione or, you know, some of these others as well. Really cool. And yeah, like you said, we have the glutathione in there. We have ancient peat extract. Can you tell yeah. us about that peat? I thought it was pear for a second, but oh, what is P-E-A-T, peat? And so I do want to point out for people who are aware of peat and are, I, when I first saw this, I was like, oh no, this is an unrenewable resource, right? It's literally peat that comes from bogs okay. um so in ancient ancient material well the company extramel that creates this raw material for us has figured out how to essentially create the benefits of these ancient peat extracts okay. but utilizing uh, I think they use apple and other things so that so it's sustainable. So we're not harvesting peat um, for it. But this is uh, what it is, is peat extract has some of the highest amounts of trace minerals and antioxidants, what we call polyphenols, another category of antioxidants that exist on the planet. Mm -hmm. So it's it's a really wonderful way to get super highly concentrated nutrients. I mean, we're not out there eating dirt every day, right? Yeah. <laughs> or peat, which peat is like literally like, you know, okay. thousands of year old plants that are rotting and broken down in each other. We're not out there eating that every day. Um, so this is a way to get those minerals that we might not have. So what's really cool about the L of ATP is that it's actually been clinically shown to increase ATP levels in our body. So the energy source, right? So this is something that kind of was originated and came out of people who are in the uh, exercise and, you know, athletic world, right. but then it's like, oh, well, we need to bring these antioxidants and, you know, defenses, um, into another world as well. So we see a lot of support for mitochondrial dysfunction and protecting from these reactive oxygen species, these free radicals with it. 
So I did see pear, uh, sorry, apple extract in there. We saw yeah, that's like you part of the peat. Yeah, yep. the cantaloupe, yep. melon. So mm -hmm. is it a good idea then to eat, maybe eat more fruits and veggies? What do you think? Hundred <laughs> percent. Eat the rainbow, right? That's yeah. the whole point. We should be getting a little bit of color all day long in our diet, um, and none of us do enough of it. Even myself, right? So well, smoothies it's hard. help. I think smoothies are underrated. You can mm -hmm. cram a bunch in there and just carry it with you and sip on it over two, three hours. As long as you're aware of what's going into your greens, yeah. right? I mean, you know, this is where we go back to Aishura. There's so many of these plants nowadays that, especially plant protein, that may have heavy metals and things in it right. from where it's growing. So, yeah, but smoothies are an incredible way. I mean, you throw in a scoop of whole earth and sea fermented greens in there. My goodness. Yeah. You <laughs> you're, you're doing... yeah, exactly. Go for it. So the Regener Life Carrier comes in a powder and capsules. Is that right? I thought it was always just yes. powder. So what's the no, main difference? No, yep. we there? just came out with capsules. It's okay. just a little bit more convenient for people yeah. um, as they are traveling. So for me, you know, I take the capsules when we when I'm traveling. I prefer the powder because I can throw it in my in my uh, drink mix in the morning. So I don't do a smoothie because I'm not living in a warm climate typically. Right. Um, but I have my you know my liquid drink that I do in the morning, and um, I love throwing that powder in there. It's higher concentrated. The powder's higher concentrated in uh, the CoQ10. So that's another reason why I usually stand with the powder but yeah if i'm traveling if somebody prefers doing it in an encapsulated form the powder has a little bit of like a melony cantaloupe flavor uh watermelony so you know if you're not a fan of that then you have options perfect yeah amazing so if you're in the store right now and you hear us discussing regener life through natural factors you might go and see the price point i mean it's not a 20 dollars supplement we're talking 45 plus but mm -hmm. This is important, guys. It's like four supplements in one. It is. It is. It's, right? yeah, you can kind of replace a lot of things. Like CoQ10's and, in there. We have glutathione in there. We have SOD. We've got the different extracts that we just discussed. Acetyl L-carnitine. Acetyl L-carnitine. Yeah, we've got, I mean, all of these amazing things. And, you know, we can't put a price on mitochondrial health at the end of the day. Um, and, you know, I have a friend that always says, says this, and I love this statement. The most expensive supplement you'll buy is the one that doesn't work. Um, mm. And the feedback that we get on people. So people who have really, really severe mitochondrial dysfunction, it might take about two to three weeks for them to notice. Um, but I am very aware of when I don't have it now. Like mm -hmm. I, my you energy is significantly lagging that day. Yeah. And I've had so many amazing, amazing um, stories being told about people that I'm like, oh, I never even thought about it for that. But yeah, mitochondria, it's the root cause. So, Amazing. Really great thing to do. So yep. that's the Regener Life. Thanks for breaking that down for us, Carrie. Mm -hmm. uh, I've taken that product. Like I said, it's like three or four supplements in one. Trust me, it guys. Is. Okay, Amazing. you're saving money with this product because mm -hmm. then you don't need some other ones to take as well. Uh, come into about like the last eight minutes or so here with Carrie. I want to hear about lipomycel matrix glutathione again yeah. there is glutathione in the regener life but this is a standalone lipo uh liposomal product let's hear about it yeah so this is something where glutathione we you know when we talk about antioxidants which we're here to talk about today glutathione is referred to as the mother of all antioxidants so hmm. you know that says something right about how important it is mainly it's referred to as the mother of all antioxidants because it recycles vitamin C and vitamin E, which are antioxidants. And we want to keep a steady state of them in our body. So glutathione being so critical for healthy aging because it's working to protect the body. Ooh, excuse me. <coughs> Bless you. <coughs> Bless me. Bless me. Bless me. I'm going to leave that in too. Ooh. I'm not cropping Oh, uh, do it. That I don't means, care. <laughs> that means it's the truth in, in Serbian such... culture. Oh. When someone sneezes while they're saying something, it means the truth. Okay, so there well, then, there you go. I did not know that. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And it is true about glutathione. <laughs> it's true. Um, so, yeah, it is. It's actually found, it should be found in really, really high amounts in our liver. It's actually part of a natural detoxification pathway process in our body. Um, I love talking about glutathione because, you know, I, I don't know, you know, I'm assuming a lot of your podcasts here, you know, we talk about women all the time. 
Yeah. And very rarely is it something like this is for men. Um, but the reality of it is, is that after the age of 40, men, men's ability to either create glutathione or have it stored in the body significantly de decreases more rapidly than females. <laughs> wow. And there's a lot of research. I see you bringing this up on periodontal health, but there's a lot of research into glutathione for, uh, Various for, issues. For various issues, yeah. including fertility. Fertility. So, you know, it's a big one for males and sperm health and, and uh, you know, fertility. But for me, it is all about anytime I think about, oh, my gosh, my liver is under stress from X, Y, or Z, glutathione is the answer. So one of the things that we know about glutathione, though, is that it's pretty rapidly oxidized. There's that word again, right? It's, yes it's it's completely broken down it ages too quickly in our gastrointestinal tract so it does make standard forms of glutathione really difficult to absorb and use right. effectively so that's why we have our patent pending technology of the lipomycel matrix where we have figured out how to stabilize it during digestion which means that you're getting enhanced absorption of it you're actually going to get this clinically effective dose of 600 milligrams mm -hmm. um in it and it's just it's an amazing product for anybody i think about you know, if you're under stress environmental stress emotional stress stress is not good for ourselves right uh or if you're especially if you're concerned about exposures to toxins in your diet or environment think about master of all antioxidants yes it's protecting our body from aging and that's the main reason i pulled this up here for the youtubers you can follow along but those listening in on audio i pulled up from the dental research journal from september october 2015. uh the point I, reason i brought this up is because it's called the antioxidant master as mm -hmm. Carrie was just mentioning, glutathione, considered to be the master antioxidant in the body, is the most important redox regulator that controls inflammation and thus damage, in this case, to the periodontium, but in any other in organ cells. system. In cells. It's found, yeah, glutathione is found in every single cell in our body. Wow. So every single cell in our body should have healthy levels of this preventing ourselves from aging but like i said it is rapidly broken down um our environment you know eats it up uh, yeah. so you know supplementing with it is really going to help um us to you know so think about toxic metals right chemicals or, yeah actually dental stuff anybody's having dental work done that'd be really great absolutely um, to be able to grab it a lot of people come over to the clinic after they get some dental work for some iv high dose uh, vitamin c as well as one of our favorites is a glutathione wow. push we do intravenously mm -hmm. after our ivs and so if you're coming into the store folks look for this bottle right here it's a blue background natural factors on the bottom right glutathione lipomycel matrix higher absorption is that because it's in the lipo version exactly yep because we figured out how to stabilize it and keep it from breaking down um and then also having yeah having that perfect potency in there and then per two soft gels you're getting 600 milligrams mm -hmm. or 0 0.6 grams is that because that's where the research shows that's all the different the benefits right correct amazing yep. mm -hmm. so here we go folks national educator of natural factors we're talking with carrie g pattison thank you for putting these on our radar yep. like you said mitochondrial health is the mo one of the most important things we could be thinking about why is that is because that's what's responsible for producing our energy on the cellular level it's and if what if that's not working we're just gradually declining right exactly yep it's you know and we think of energy as like ah, energy um, but really, we're talking about we need energy for our heart to beat. That's we need energy to digest our food. We need energy for our to get nutrients to our brain. Energy is the fuel in our body to have it do anything. Like I'm not going to be able to move my finger without mitochondrial right. energy. Life energy, life force. It's not exactly. just you being energetic. It's you're on a cellular level. We're on talking about energy. On a cellular level. Amazing. Ooh, speaking of that, I'll yeah. leave you with this. I heard a customer say about uh, the Regenera Life that it made them feel um, focused and energized like a cup of coffee without the negative jitter. So I that's thought a good that headline a really... for this this episode title. 
Say yeah, that one yeah. again. Uh, it was, I'll go and find the actual quote for <laughs> okay. you and send it to you. Cause yes. it, it was very state. It was stated much better than I'm stating it right now okay. off the top of my head, but it was something along the lines of like all the benefits of coffee without the, you know, without the caffeine jitters. Um, so pretty cool as far as like energy. Oh yeah. It was energy on a cellular level is, is really a cool thing to think about without energy the jitters, without the anxiety. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Because yeah. anxiety is, yeah, it might be pent up energy, but that's like a negative form of energy, right? Exactly. Yeah. And, um, you know, I mean, we can go back to this idea of maybe free radicals are causing chaos in your body. You need some more antioxidants to help balance out everything and keep, keep our cells from aging like that icky avocado or, t or apple, which I still eat those icky ones. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you still yeah it's gonna do more good than harm still exactly. probably yeah so regenerate life comes in the powder almost a three ounce it's like 2.86 ounces mm -hmm. then we have the capsule version as well and then the liposomal the lipomycel glutathione that one only comes in soft gels correct correct yes amazing yep. natural factors always has some kind of line drive going on they have incredible mm -hmm. price points very competitive company and again one of the only supplement companies in our entire store here that's Isura certified, which we've talked about in past episodes with Carrie, the importance of Isura certification. Mm -hmm. And here we are in the last minute or so. Give us a little recap about today, Carrie, antioxidants, energy production, mitochondria. Well, antioxidants are the rainbow colors that are in our food. And the whole point of them is to prevent ourselves. They work with and with free radicals, which are could be considered the evil guys, they neutralize the free radicals, keep everybody happy, keep our cells happy. So we're aging at a slower process. Um, and our mitochondria play a critical role in that as well. They're our energy source, our energy production, and they age rapidly too if we don't have good, healthy amounts of antioxidants in our body. So, you know, supplementing with a uh, antioxidant is really brilliant because probably not getting it from our food anymore. So we want to eat the rainbow and we want to come in and grab some of these amazing, amazing products that can really help to boost your body's ability to neutralize those free radicals. Amazing. Perfect place to end it there. And one last clarification. I know if we do a scoop of the Regener Life, yes. you know, you're getting glutathione in there. Mm -hmm. So now imagine I take 600 milligrams extra of the lipo version. Mm -hmm. There's no harm in that, right? No, no. side. Shouldn't be an issue. Yeah, shouldn't be an issue. I might only do one soft gel of the Should, glutathione. If you're right? taking the Regener Life yeah. as well. Yeah, just as an everyday. But of course, you know, like right now, um, I have forest fires going around me. So I'm doing more glutathione. I'm right. doing more lung bronchial and sinus. I'm doing more of the Regener Life because I know my body is under even more of this stress. Good luck trying to overdose on glutathione, right? I mean, if you're getting yeah, exactly. a gram or two grams, I'm pretty sure that's not going to be the thing that causes that's issues. That's not going to be hey, a problem. Don't quote us on that. Always work with your doc. Thank yeah. you, Carrie, for your time. Thank Always you. appreciate you. All right. See you guys next time.